Well, Plus TV News captured INEX distribution of sensitive election materials in states across the Federation. The report. In Oshun State, the distribution of sensitive election materials was not without a mild drama at the premises of the Central Bank of Nigeria, Oshogbo branch. Operatives of the Department of State Services stationed at the entrance to the bank prevented journalists and observers from entering into the premises. The claim the management of the CBN had instructed that no one be allowed into the premise. This took a while before access was given. Speaking with journalists, the state resident electoral commissioner assured that the commission was fully ready for the polls. Here this morning, to start the batching of our materials to various local government for one world transmission to this local government. Now, what you have seen on ground are the ballot papers, resource sheet of presidential election, senatorial election, and as a representative with their you know, resource sheet. Now, we are going to arrange them painstakingly, take them one after the other, you know, array by array, local government by local government, unit by unit, everything will be badged and we will transport them to various local government. The SPOs have been trained, the APOs have been trained, the coalition officers have been trained, and all of them, when you see all these things happening, they are clear indication that the election on Saturday is a settled matter. Election materials moved to 16 local government areas in Ekiti State. The exercise was witnessed by representatives of political parties and the interstate party advisory councils. Journalists and observers were present. The resident electoral commissioner in Ekiti State, however, mentioned that the persistent fuel scarcity and cash crunch would not affect the conduct of the elections in Ekiti. I want to assure you that the cash crunch will not affect the mobilization and all the activity of INEC because as of now, we have received the necessary cash that we need to conduct this election. And in terms of the uh, logistics with respect to fuel, we also have adequate fuel to, for all our activities. After a thorough investigation and inspection by representatives of political parties, INEC Rec and Benway State handed over the election materials for onward transmission to 23 local government areas of the state. To check. And uh, these sensitive materials are already batched into local governments, ballot papers and answer sheets, uh, in order to show that we are not hiding anything. All our transactions are on top of the table, not under the table. I wish to confirm that uh, the materials for the start of this election have been with us. Like you say, the resident electoral commission we have uh, officially handed over to him as he has signed all our documents. So from now on, well, the job is now on the scope on how to distribute these materials to the various local governments. Professor Sam Egu also revealed that the commission was in touch with the CBN and NNPC to tackle the logistics problem of cash and petrol during the exercise and assured Nigerians that the commission was ready to conduct credible elections. What INEC has done is to walk through the central bank for INEC offices across the country to have access to the amount of cash they need for their operations. We don't have problem with the central bank here in terms of that discussion. You know we are also conducting this election in the context of a national crisis. Uh, you cannot find petrol, you cannot find AGO. Again, we have leveraged on the initiative that INEC at headquarters has taken. And we have been able to, to liberate or conserve some thousands of liters of uh, petrol and AGO. As I'm talking to you, I'm confident that fueling our operational vehicles will not be one of the challenges in this election that we are conducting in the next few days. 
In Nassau State, Aina Correg said the sensitive materials for distribution compromised the ballot papers, result sheets, and bimodal voter accreditation system beavers for onward transmission to 3,245 polling units across the state. <laughs> Representatives of political parties, international local elections observers were visibly present at the central bank headquarters in Kaduna State to monitor dispatchment of sensitive election materials. We are in receipt of some of the monies we will require for the execution of the uh, election, not for all aspects of the election. For instance, the corpus that we are going to engage, we intend to give them cash for some of their allowances, not all their allowances. Again, with respect to transportation, we've engaged the NURTW and NATO, we have talked with them and we have agreed with them that we are going to give them part of their money uh, in cash. So I can assure you that we are, as I'm talking with you now, in receipt of some of those monies. As Nigerians proceed to the polls, all eyes are the election umpire to live up to expectation in the delivery of credible results and the collision of votes. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.